You can put whatever word you want in front of it. Road, wheel, a sin or a state. A tax is a tax is a travesty. Yes. Counselor, it's probably a goof, but your campaign website says salsa as an issue. What does it mean? Oh no, please don't. Just don't say... Mexican spies are conspiring to replace our old-fashioned American ketchup with salsa. Hijo de la chingada, te voy a partir toda tu madre. A master's degree in the booming field of French literature. Not my greatest idea. Mad. For some reason, the job search hadn't worked out quite as well as I'd like. Mad. Despite my own personal beliefs, I decided to join the mayoral campaign of J.D. Lampert. I want to give to my community. Fuck. Counselor, I just... I don't know why you can't. You can't squelch me, son. The truth just busts out. Oh. Two days. I know. Two days. I can't believe he did that. We had that media event planned to a T. One more big screw up like this and we're all done. And you get to go back to being a waiter. Barista. I gotta stop drinking coffee. It ages you. Yep. The town hall. In two days. He's not ready. He needs more preparation. I I'm gonna schedule more rehearsal time. I've already put so much time into that yut. Yeah, but it's all for nothing if he fails this town hall event. Why was Salsa still on the issues page of the website? Did no one here think that somebody was going to ask about that? We knew it was on there. We did? The counselor is very passionate about his condiments. Please go. Two days, Andy. <sighs> All right, counselor. One last, one last time. If we are gonna make up for lost ground, we need to engage these voters face to face. Damn straight. All right, so what are you gonna do? I'm gonna walk up to the door. I'm gonna ring that bell. Yes, sir. And I'm gonna pull my gun no, out. No, sir, we... I'm gonna engage the voter about issues that matter to me, like Second Amendment rights. Counselor Lambert... Oh. The last time you literally waved your gun and service record... Ah. The guy thought it was a home invasion. Oh, yeah, that's the Third Amendment. I'm big on that one, too. Okay, 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 okay. Mm. We are gonna walk up to that door, ring that bell calmly, no gun, speak with our neighbors, and try and get them involved in the political process. Fine. Hi, I'm Counselor Lambert. Go! <laughs> All right, Counselor. Now, this is an easy one. The wastewater infrastructure within the city limits is beginning to crumble. Oh, no! Yes. So, what would your mayoral administration do to fix this? Pass. Pass on the poop question. Counselor, I voted for your opponent for the past two years. Why change horses now? 
Well, ma'am, we vote for uh, people, not horses. But if you're gonna vote for a horse, why vote for the old horse? Vote for a new horse. Strong, full of life, well hung, shiny new mane, well groomed. <laughs> the kind of bred in America horse you'd let take your daughter out. Maybe they have a nice meal, go back to his place afterwards. <laughs> Damn, vote for horses. <laughs> Okay, sir, but my question was actually going to be... And, if the horse is old, it should be sent off to be made into glue. Next question. Sir, I, I don't think that that's... I said, next question, Sydney. Keep up. Why do you want to be mayor, John? Why wouldn't I? I mean, come on, the opportunity to help my fellow citizens of this great town with their problems. And yes, there are problems. And yes, they aren't always easy to solve. But trying to solve them, that's worth it. It's worth everything. God, this, you're gonna get it. Just remember, you're probably not the dumbest guy in that room. And, and just don't talk about horses or, or condiments and- Don't smell anyone. And don't talk about guns. Welcome to the first town hall event for the 2016 Knoxville mayoral election. Let's begin. He's got this. He's so got this. I hope so. Why do you want to be mayor? Well, sir, I want to be mayor because I want the opportunity to help. But to help my fellow citizens with their problems. And yes, there are problems. We shouldn't be afraid to admit that. And yes, they're not easy to solve, but we're going to try. Our great city's worth it. And let me tell you, sir, those problems are going to get a lot easier to solve. Oh, God. When I dump every immigrant spy over the town line, let Chattanooga deal with them and their goddamn salsa. <laughs> Eres un estupido, idiota! Merde.